Hey there, welcome to this quick lecture where I want to tell you a critical piece of information. Say you're all fired up and you want to create a designer account on 99designs. You want to earn money as fast as possible and jump right in. While that's the perfect attitude for this competitive field, you need to first do one thing. Set up a portfolio and show it to me and to the other students on Discord. That's because 99designs doesn't allow any designer to create an account and start submitting entries. They've started to vet designers based on their portfolio. This means that when you register, you'll have to submit at least 4 or 5 designs of your own. Now in general this isn't such a big deal, but the guys at 99designs are super serious about it. If you get rejected, you're out for an entire year. Yeah, you heard that right. If they don't like your portfolio, you're not allowed to participate in design contests on their platform and you can't have another go unless one year passes. To me, that's ridiculous. I think it's far too extreme. People can get better after a couple of weeks. But anyway, it's their decision and that's that. There's nothing I can do for you. I can't put in a good word or anything like that. What I can do is prevent a lot of disappointment. A few of my students sent in their portfolio, they got rejected and now they have to wait an entire year. That's heartbreaking and that's because they didn't ask for my review, they didn't ask for my help. Now sure, you can go to DesignCrowd or any other freelancing platform, but it's still a big letdown. Now to see your work, it's best you create a Behance profile and you send me that link. If you don't want to set up a portfolio on Behance, that's fine. What you can do is you can go to imager.com and upload all your designs one after another. After that's done, send me this link, preferably on the channel called 99designs. One thing that's really important is that you should not use my designs when you try to register on 99designs.com. You have to create your own variations that are different enough from my design. If the guys from 99designs spot the same entry over and over, you're very likely to get rejected and I wouldn't want that to happen. Furthermore, if you want to get more designs in your portfolio, I strongly recommend my 40 practical projects course. This is not about me selling you another thing, but because there are so many projects in that course, that may help you not only build a portfolio, but also learn some new design techniques. So that's another thing you can do. Overall, please don't submit your work to 99designs without getting it looked at on Discord. You'll regret it, especially since this is all free. And by the way, when you're on Discord, don't just expect for people to review your own work. Please do your best and write a few thoughts of your own about their designs as well. This is a community, it's about giving and receiving, so please don't just ask for help, give it as well. Even though you may not have my level of experience, it still helps if you write a few words. Thank you and I look forward to seeing your portfolio.